Damn, I hope this guy is all right. Watch me burn all of my art in a big pile in my front yard. Free event. I am a bad artist and I just suck. My art is all trash. Please bring your awful art, poetry and music is okay, and add it to the big pile in my front yard. And we will stop when we run out of fuel. When? After work, Saturday. I commiserate on a deep emotional level. <laughs> Don't, don't do it though. I threw out my sketchbook in like seventh or eighth grade. I was really into scale modeling and I could, I could not get stuff perfect down to like the millimeter and I threw the entire thing away and now I regret it. Most of what I make is still trash, but I, I at least just like enjoy the fact that the trash exists. Weird ashtray. No, that, that's beyond weird. That's beyond cursed. That is uncomfortably unfamiliar and far too moist. Mm, greetings, um, this is my baby. Oh, you're like an action figure. Dude looks like he's up to it too. He's like, yes. I'm concerned as to the absolute volume of bananas. I I'm hoping this is a zoo or a place where people really like bananas. Or they were making a lot of like banana products, banana pudding, banana bread. That That's a lot of banana bread. This bathtub in the middle of the forest. This does not surprise me at all. You find the weirdest stuff in the middle of the forest. When I was like in first or second grade, I had like a... A older, like, you know, the older brother kind of things where they set you up with like a seventh or eighth grader. And uh, we hang out, we hung out a few times. Um, he went into the woods near my old house and there was just like a pickup there and he knew about it. And we just like sat and talked about video games. I'm not entirely sure what the point of that entire program was, but I had no idea there was a pickup. I'm just <laughs> sitting without, with no wheels, sitting in the forest by my house. Okay, as long as it doesn't move. Oh, I just zoomed in. I'm disappointed in all of you. Look, I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of this. That wallpaper is way too nice for this entire situation and I'm uncomfortable. Do what you wanna do, just do it behind closed doors, all right? Also, get some ice water. God, it's, it's freaking melting. Thanks, I hate realistic bee drill. Good Lord almighty, all right, I have not looked at the image yet. I hate bees, I hate bees. Oh, this is gonna be so bad. Oh, this is gonna be, so off. No, it's it's slightly less photorealistic than I was expecting, but I still hate it. If you ever wanted to see me speed build a flamethrower, no, I'm not gonna teach you how, but I will build one very quickly if that thing ever exists in real life. I couldn't tell if that was supposed to be a belly button or like a tiny eye for the longest time. And and still, I mainly see the balloon. This one doesn't didn't work on me as, as well as I had hoped. Previous reader used hair as a bookmark. Uh, I don't think that's a bookmark. I think that's, that's a keepsake. Hopefully it was, uh, taken under normal and sweet circumstances, but it's also in a freaking paper towel. So, <laughs> like a lock of hair in like a locket or, or like inside of a really cute note or, t you know, that can be kind of cute. It's kind of old fashioned, but kind of cute. Th this is, this doesn't look right. I'm really surprised you did not, not get your insides turned outsides while painting a bull as Spider-Man. Got way more bravery than I do. And uh, I'm completely fine with that. I want to hate it, but it kind of works. It's, it's, it's a very, very, very tall baseball cap. I'm not opposed. I am going to send it to somebody who I know is a fan of hats though. And they are going to hate it. Are you just stacking up the number of nights you'll never be able to sleep again? They'll remember this. They have nine lives. Like, you will not be able to stop this. I just I just feel bad for this cat. I'm assuming this was from like, I don't know, lice or something. It's some sort of skin condition that they had to shave everything off. The poor guy just looks so like confused and scared. It's the hamster. I love Richard Hammer. The a couple of friends and I used to basically trade terrible Top Gear jokes, and I was always hamming because he's the hyper one. I'm I'm going to blame that giant block of cheese on James May. Like, there's there's no other reasonable expl explanation. Coffin windows on hospital doors. Oh, that is a very unfortunate design. Did they did they really have to? Even if it was the mortuary, even if it was like the um, is it called a mortuary at a hospital? The the area where people go if they don't make it. Um, even if it's that area, you don't need the no. You don't need to advertise that. Thanks. I hate Kirkland's signature parchment cookie toes. That, that was a, oh God. Why did they put that on there? That can't be the official, like actual artwork 
hang on. Okay, I didn't look closely at the first one. I didn't realize the uh, the toes toenails were painted on, but but that is the actual artwork, and I I now can't unsee it. It just looks like a foot. For like two seconds, it looked like a bathtub or a hot tub, and I was like, that's gonna be really small. And then I realized that the handles, and oh my god, that's amazing. No, that's that's freaking hilarious. If you have a good enough sense of humor, I know this is an art installation because I see the gallery wall behind, but if if this was a real thing and you have good enough humor to be buried in a, an igloo or a cooler of some kind, I'm laughing at your funeral because I, 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 I know that's what you would want. I mean, mood. <sighs> I'm not gonna say the cat is a bad driver, mostly because uh, I, do, I, I don't want it to be friends with the one that was getting flicked off like five images ago. Hail Mary, full of rocks. What even, was this on purpose? This looks like it was mostly on purpose. You can never tell. Like maybe it was something they left in a cave or something. But no, apparently they left somebody else in a cave and they came out with a bunch of rocks and stuffed them into a statue. And uh, now we have a religious figurine made out of uh, rocks. Yeah. <laughs> This will never not be funny. I know how old it is. I don't care. It will never not be funny. I don't like this. I don't, I don't like this at all. I, I, I'm perfectly aware of optical illusions. Doesn't mean I like them. I wonder how many dogs like actually think that the direction of the leash indicates like the direction of walk that they're actually going to go in. Like if the owner flips the leash around, if will the dog like actually pull them in that direction? Are there dog psychologists? How did this turn into like a behavioral st study about dogs? I don't, I'm, I'm sorry. This one screwed me up for five seconds because I couldn't tell if it was actually like that because I, I don't think I've ever seen that brand or I, I haven't looked for that brand of toilet cleaner, I think. And the, the yellow top, I was like, did you put that on there? Is that, is that intentional? And it's really shiny. It looks almost ceramic. No, this is cute. This is something I would do. I, I love it so much. This is somebody who just came from or is going to music theater, off Broadway, something, play, performance, that kind of stuff. Genuinely, you see this kind of stuff in New York all the time. The print almost matches some of the uh, the uptown crosstown, like the crosstown buses that are, have the extensions, but there are no seats that face backwards. So I know this isn't in New York, but yeah, if you ever see somebody in New York, especially late at night, that's like way overdressed or wearing all black and black tie or something like that uh, and carrying any sort of oddly shaped case, uh, it's orchestra musicians. They, they got off and they, they can't get out of the hall until 30 minutes after everyone. Yeah, no, it's it's that. This is what some of the areas where all of your cables run through look like. Seriously, the number of murder basements I've had to work out of for like several days at a time. But yeah, in these kind of situations, you're just happy to find like a chair and a table and some power and crank some tunes because you're going to be there for like 14 hours punching down a bunch of cables. So you may as well set up some YouTube, set up some music and just, you know, turn it into a party. Dolls at a local store. Oh, the one on the left is a doll. The one on the right isn't. I do have to wonder, like, were these toys in the traditional sense? Because, like, even as a child, like, I never played with dolls. I was a strange kid. I just wanted computers and robots. Uh, but, 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 like, if there was a doll as tall as me, I wouldn't be able to actually play with it or interact with it. So they, they have to be display pieces for adults, which, which is fine, but that's a lot of work. It's impressive work. It's a shame that this much skill and crafts and shit goes into something that looks so creepy. Like, I just, I feel bad for the person making it because, like, it's impressive. This is something I could never do in a million years. The window was open, so I let myself in. Thank you for looking. Oh, Jesus. Oh God, oh, I had that, I had that actually zoomed in. Ah, ah. Also, I had to assemble that was a painting in my brain because I just recognized Long Furby and thought it was just like a glitched out picture. And then I was like, no, wait, it's like liquid. And how is it getting its self support? Oh, it's painting. Fantastic. This, this is hilarious and fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> There's three sides to cosplay. There's the ultra realistic nerds who go into like working armor and all of that kind of stuff. There's the people that can do like amazing photos where they do all the makeup and stuff perfect for the character. And like from certain angles, you can't tell it. It begins to like merge with reality. It's so cool. And then you know, have people that look at real life mascots and go, I'm gonna make that funny. And I think those are my favorite cosplayers. <laughs> Okay, this one, this one took me a minute because I didn't realize the hairline wasn't shaved intentionally. I'm sure there's like an actual genetic reason for this. I don't know. If it bothers you, though, uh, I can interest you in a cut up cowboy hat. Can't forget my shoes. Can't forget, can't forget my shoes. This is the equivalent of an ADHD person running around the house looking for their glasses when it's they're on top of your head. Yeah. No, this is cool. No, this is, this is fantastic. I love this. This is not weird. This is awesome. People are far too boring with their hair. Like, you have this canvas on your head that you can dye any color and cut to any shape and you flip the front up a little bit and shave the sides and call it a day. Like, come on! That's, that's a new one. 
Are they actually attached? I can't tell if it's just riding on top of the sneaker, like one of those boot covers, or if it's actually sewn on. That that's that's a a trend for, of one person. I, I if you're trying to get more people to do it, good luck. Did you press that into your cat to get that, or did was it born like that? I am so confused because the hair is flared out. I'm pretty sure you did this on purpose. And then they all went to heaven. Oh yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm sorry. Oh. I mean, he was persuasive and ineffective. How do you think he got hired as an ad mascot? Look, any screen in a storm, especially if you're used to a gaming setup and then you go home to your parents' house and the only screen is that one, it'll do. This new Lego Duplo ad has a kid that looks and is dressed exactly like me in the early 90s playing with my Duplo box. Okay, I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna say that's a very common kid's style. Like kid's styles are just like, it's like the static of the boring section of a department store um, mixed with primary colors. That's like the entire range. But the looks carry it over the, the finish line. Like that's pretty fantastic. Wedding with a guest of a, is that L Lam Lama Man? L Yama? Uh, oh, I, I don't, Ch champagne? is poisonous to llama um oh llama man <laughs> Okay, I'm, I'm, I try not to pick on people's spelling, but my, my dude, Llama has two L's. Guest has a U in it. Champagne has a G. You know the red squiggly lines? Those don't mean you get extra points. That's a fantastic thing. Uh, did, did they give the llamas a champagne? Like, you can put apple juice in those, you know? And some people just don't drink. Good lord, that's a lot of, like, best men to people to have in your wedding. Jesus Christ. Like, two, I had two bridesmaids. What the frack? A mask found at a yard sale. Oh! Oh, God, the box. The box it comes comes in is somehow makes it way worse because the box doesn't look like it should fit it yet it's presented on it like this is the box for the item but it doesn't fit that's the point like it comes in this box and once you open it it doesn't ever go back in the box and to break the curse you have to put it back in the box but the box is cursed and never be able to fit the mask in it ah thanks i hate crocheted fake nails uh, 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 oh god no 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 no, oh God, why does that bother me so much? Oh, I can feel it. Ah, if you ever had any doubt about like social media turning people into clowns, like they're, you know, they're really social media people. Uh, uh, they, well, he, here's your undoubted, here's your, uh, your dose of undoubtment. Can't even tell how old this kid person thing is. Like, I, I'm just so confused by this. I don't like it. Oh, I see the cat got its revenge. Instead of killing everyone, it just merged them all into one octopus. Frozen in the last position that they gave the cat. This is incidentally also my attitude towards mayonnaise personified or octos, uh, octopusified. That doesn't sound right. If the multiverse theory is real, we can assume there exists an earth where orangutans are farmed for their nutritious and surprisingly sweet milk. No, 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 stop. Why does it sound like you are the spokesperson for a company that wants to milk orangutans? I don't like this. This is very uncomfortable. Please take your startup somewhere else. I've seen this. I have this set too. I don't have the skills to make that, but this is a, a, a Lego. They said you could build anything. So I built this. Dude, if I had a goat, I'd give it a giant bowl of spaghetti. I hope that's spaghetti. I'm gonna choose to believe it's spaghetti. March 3rd at 6 o'clock p.m. Minnesota was hit with a completely pink sky. That's really pretty. Suddenly vaporwave everywhere. I've seen pink sunsets, but uh, that's something else. I don't know how that happens. Somebody got a photo of my eyes up close. Yeah, they're, they're just hot pink all the way back. They don't work well, but they look cool. Yes, bring your hedgehogs. The ritual begins. Tonight, we summon Snock. If anybody gets it wrong, they end up uh, summoning Shadow. The original Ronald McDonald, 1964. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, what the hell? I don't know if this is real and I'm not going through the effort of, God, the mouth, God, God, the mouth. The nose is bad, but the, oh, oh. There's a, there's a difference between enthusiasm and joy and older designs make that very apparent. Focus used to be on just pure enthusiasm and still sometimes you see that. People being way too excited for stuff that is not that exciting. But I don't think any of them come off this terrifying. Shopping for school supplies. Oh, we've seen this before. I don't think you were actually shopping for school 
school supplies when you saw this. I think you stole this from somewhere else. I love this. I love this on a spiritual level. Weird core and vaporwave and like some weird corporate operating system BS stuff has been flowing through my head a lot lately. And this is right up my alley. Now, these are, these are people that, that just uh, haven't had their to textures loaded yet. I actually have a green and a pink one of these for green screens because the green one lets you blend into the green screen and lets you do like floating head stuff. And the pink one is exactly the opposite of green. You can use blue too, but I've had problems with like blue getting weird shadows. Pink, one, best color. Two, jumps right off that green screen. So easy to key out. But n now I want to like get a couple friends and go eat stuff off a table or go play chess on like a random subway. Kind of, what in the, this is in English, but, but uh, that, uh, a small succulent native to South Africa and Southern Namibia looks as weird as weird goes. There's far too many, oh God. Oh God, no, thank you. No, why are there lips? Uh, why are there so many vowels? Did you make it hard to say because it has its own mouth and should say its own name? Maybe we should ask it how it's pronounced. Come, sit, maybe we can chit chat. <laughs> Just the, the observation chair. But there's nobody in it. There's nobody you can see. I like that the cat was, as per usual, hogging all the heat, and the turtle was just like, no, dude, I need that. You're warm bloodied. You'll be fine without it. Windows suction cups acted as magnifying glass and melted my pillows. Lord, that's terrifying. Oh, yeah, no, that, that would definitely, that's... Very clear and very fo wow. I'd read somewhere that there was a theory behind crystal balls being evil and that they should be covered up because they would focus the light and set things in the room on fire. And that's why they needed to be covered. Okay, I, I only know of the General Dynamics laptop and the Itronics Go Books that can run under three feet of water. That looks like an older Inspiron or Latitude. I'm more impressed that you got the tent down there. Either way, absolutely fantastic. I love it. Approved, thank you, remove card. Doo -doo -doo. It's Magic the Gathering. I mean, the chip on the front of your credit card, you can technically, you'd probably get questions and stuff like that, but you could technically remove that and put it on anything. This is not financial advice, but uh, it's it's technology facts. <laughs> Go forth and confuse every cashier in the country. Just be nice to them afterwards because they don't make nearly enough. 